In spring of uh, 2018, we were able to spend a lot of time in northwest Oklahoma doing some other work, and that gave us the opportunity to film a bunch of rattlesnakes and a few other amazing, cool animals. And so here's some of the footage from that spring of a western diamondback rattlesnake. Here we have a, uh, a young western diamondback rattlesnake. This guy is um, actually being pretty still for us, so I'm going to try and get some photos. If you, if you look close at this guy's face, you can see he has those uh, pits on, on the front of his face. That's where these guys get the name Pit Viper from. They have those uh, pits that help them detect heat and enable them to hunt in the darkness. Western diamondback rattlesnakes are unfortunately uh, killed a lot of times because they they do possess they do possess venom that uh, can give someone a nasty bite. Uh, you would not want to get bitten by one, and if you were to be bitten by one, you would want to uh, call nine one one, head to the nearest hospital immediately. Uh, do not try to put on a tourniquet. Do not try to um, do not try to you know cut the wound or anything. A lot of that stuff is old wives' tales. Uh, you'd want to seek medical treatment as quick as possible. Um, most people will survive a bite from a Western Diamondback if they um, if they're in reasonably good health and they get to a medical center and and don't delay treatment. Uh, you definitely want to take a bite from one of these guys very seriously, even though it's not really likely to happen unless you're kind of messing around in their territory. Uh, this guy right here is doing everything possible to stay away from us. He's definitely not moving in our direction. And um, pretty much just keeps wanting to back away, so... Uh, guys, uh, thank you for watching this video. Uh, please hit the like and subscribe button on the way out. And remember, if you're going to admire these guys, uh, do so from a distance. Uh, thanks again for watching.